The 10 Most Famous Works of Art by Vincent van Gogh Vincent van Gogh is one of the most iconic and influential artists in the history of art. His works, full of color, emotion and movement, have been admired for decades for their originality and expressiveness. His unique style and innovative technique have made him one of the most iconic artists in the history of art. Although Van Gogh was not very successful during his lifetime, his artistic legacy continues to be admired around the world. His works have inspired many artists over the years and his unique style and innovative technique continue to be studied and appreciated around the world. Van Gogh is a true legend of art and his legacy will live on forever in his stunning works. Here is a list of the 10 most famous works by Vincent Van Gogh. Number 10. Café Terrace at Night. Café Terrace at Night is one of the most famous paintings by Vincent Van Gogh. It was painted in 1888 during his stay in Arles in the south of France. The painting shows a night scene in a café on the Place du Forum, one of the main squares in Arles. The composition of the painting is very dynamic, with a series of figures seated at outdoor tables, surrounded by warm lights and bright colors. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of yellow, red, blue and green, to create a nocturnal environment full of life and movement. Artificial light from street lamps and window lights is reflected on the tables and figures, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. The scene is very lively, with figures of all ages and social classes sitting at tables, talking and enjoying a glass of wine or beer. Van Gogh captures the essence of nightlife in Arles, showing a relaxed and friendly atmosphere. The patrons seem to be enjoying a warm and pleasant evening, and the atmosphere is very different from the loneliness and sadness found in some of his other works. Overall, Café Terrace at Night is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the nightlife of Arles in a lively and colorful way. With his innovative use of color and dynamic composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement, which continues to be admired around the world. Number 9. The Starry Night Over the Rhone The Starry Night Over the Rhone is one of the most famous paintings by Vincent van Gogh. It was painted in 1888 during his stay in Arles, in the south of France. The painting represents a night view of the Rhone River and the city of Arles, with a sky full of bright stars. The composition of the painting is very dramatic, with a large night sky filled with stars and a Rhone River meandering through the composition. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of blue and green, to create a nocturnal environment full of life and movement. Artificial light from street lamps and window lights reflects off the river, creating a warm and inviting atmosphere. The city of Arles looks like a series of lights and shadows, with buildings and houses illuminated by the moon and stars. Van Gogh captures the essence of nightlife in Arles, showing a relaxed and friendly atmosphere. However, unlike the lively scene in Café Terrace at Night, the city in Starry Night Over the Rhone is more calm and serene. The starry sky is the protagonist of the work, with the stars drawn with great detail and great realism. Van Gogh captures the beauty and majesty of the night sky, with great contrast between the bright stars and the dark sky. The moon also has an important role in the composition, with its warm and soft light that illuminates the river and the city. Overall, the starry night over the Rhone is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and majesty of nocturnal nature. With his innovative use of color and dramatic composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement that continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art. Number 8. The Red Vineyard. The Red Vineyard is one of the most representative paintings by Vincent Van Gogh. It was painted in 1888 during his stay in Arles 
in the south of France, and is considered one of the most important works in his vineyard series. The composition of the painting is very dramatic, with a large vineyard in the foreground and a cloudy sky in the background. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of red, violet and orange, to create an environment full of life and movement. The natural light of the sun is reflected in the leaves of the vineyard, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. The vineyard is the protagonist of the work, with the red grape vines drawn with great detail and realism. Van Gogh captures the essence of country life, showing a relaxed and friendly atmosphere. However, unlike the lively scene in Coffee Terrace at Night, or the nocturnal nature of Starry Night over the Rhone, the atmosphere in The Red Vineyard is more calm and serene. The cloudy sky is another important element in the composition, with the clouds drawn with great realism and detail, and a great contrast between the red and violet tones of the vineyard and the gray and white tones of the sky. The sun is reflected in the clouds, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. Overall, the Red Vineyard is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and majesty of nature. With his innovative use of color and dramatic composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement that continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his series of vineyards and one of the most famous in the history of art. Number 7. Wheat Field with Crows Wheat Field with Crows is one of the most iconic paintings by Vincent van Gogh. It was painted in 1890, during his stay in auvers sur oise a small town near Paris. The painting represents a wheat field with a pair of crows flying over it. The composition of the painting is very dramatic, with a large field of wheat in the foreground and a cloudy sky in the background. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with yellow, brown and gray tones, to create an environment full of life and movement. The natural light of the sun reflects off the leaves of the wheat, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. The wheat field is the protagonist of the work, with the wheat leaves drawn with great detail and realism. Van Gogh captures the essence of country life, showing a relaxed and friendly atmosphere. However, unlike the animated scene of Coffee Terrace at Night, or the nocturnal nature of The Starry Night Over the Rhone, or the tranquility of the countryside in The Red Vineyard, in Wheat Field with Cuervos, the atmosphere is a bit more gloomy and sad. The crows are another important element in the composition, with the birds flying over the wheat field. Ravens symbolize loneliness, sadness and death and their presence in the work adds a profound and symbolic dimension. The cloudy sky is another important element in the composition, with the clouds drawn with great realism and detail, and a great contrast between the yellow tones of the wheat and the gray and white tones of the sky. Overall, Wheat Field with Crows is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and majesty of nature, but also has a profound and symbolic dimension. With his innovative use of color and dramatic composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement that continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art. Number 6. Vase with Lilies. Vase with Lilies is one of the most famous paintings by Vincent Van Gogh. It was painted in 1889, during his stay at St. Paul de Mosseli, a psychiatric asylum in St. Remy de Provence. The painting represents a vase with lilies, placed on a table with a white cloth. The composition of the painting is very simple, with the vase and the lilies in the foreground and a dark background. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of yellow, white and green, to create an environment full of life and movement. Natural sunlight reflects off the vase and the lily pads, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. The vase and the lilies are the protagonist of the work, with the flowers drawn with great detail and realism. 
Van Gogh captures the essence of the beauty and delicacy of flowers, showing a relaxed and pleasant atmosphere. However, unlike the lively scene of Coffee Terrace at Night, or the nocturnal nature of The Starry Night Over the Rhone, or the tranquility of the countryside in The Red Vineyard, or the symbolism in Trigal con Cuervos in Vase with Lilies, the atmosphere is purer and simpler. It is important to note that this painting is one of a series of vase paintings with flowers that Van Gogh painted during his stay in the psychiatric asylum, in which the artist sought refuge and solace in nature, and especially in flowers. The representation of the flowers as a symbol of purity and beauty, can be interpreted as a reflection of his desires and feelings at that moment. Overall, Vase with Lilies is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and delicacy of flowers, but also has a personal and symbolic dimension. With his innovative use of color and simple composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement that continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art. In addition, the painting is considered a reflection of his mental and emotional state at that time, where he sought solace and refuge in nature and flowers. Number 5. Skull with a Cigarette. Skull with a Cigarette is one of the least known paintings by Vincent van Gogh, but it is considered one of his most interesting and provocative works. It was painted in 1885-86, during his stay in Noonan, a small town in the Netherlands. The painting represents a skull with a cigarette in its mouth, in a dark and sinister environment. The composition of the painting is very dramatic, with a large skull in the foreground and a dark background. Van Gogh used a somber and saturated color palette, with shades of gray, black and white, to create an atmosphere full of mystery and tension. Artificial light from a lamp is reflected on the skull, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. The skull is the protagonist of the work, with the bones drawn with great detail and realism. Van Gogh captures the essence of death, showing a sinister and gloomy atmosphere. The presence of the cigarette in the skull's mouth adds a profound and symbolic dimension, which can be interpreted as a reflection of the artist's relationship with death and the transience of life. It is important to note that this painting is one of a series of funeral-themed paintings that Van Gogh painted during his stay in Noonan, in which the artist faced the death of his father and his own early death. He. The representation of death as a reminder of the transience of life can be interpreted as a reflection of his feelings and concerns at that moment. In general, Skull with a Cigarette is a lesser-known work by Van Gogh, but it is considered to be one of his most interesting and provocative works. With his innovative use of color and dramatic composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of mystery and tension, which continues to be admired for its depth and symbolism. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art, reflecting his confrontation with death and the transience of life. Number 4. Almond Blossom. Almond Blossom is one of the most famous paintings by Vincent van Gogh. It was painted in 1890, during his stay in auvers sur oise a small town near Paris. The painting represents an almond tree in blossom, with the branches covered with white and pink flowers, in a spring atmosphere. The composition of the painting is very simple, with the almond tree in the foreground and a blue background. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of pink, white and blue, to create an environment full of life and movement. The natural light of the sun reflects on the leaves and flowers of the almond tree, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. The almond tree is the protagonist of the work, with the branches and flowers drawn with great detail and realism. Van Gogh captures the essence of the beauty and delicacy of spring, showing a relaxed and pleasant atmosphere. The blossoming almond tree is a symbol of spring and life, and its presence in the work adds a symbolic and poetic dimension. 
The blue background is another important element in the composition, with a great contrast between the pink and white tones of the almond tree and the blue tones of the sky. The blue sky symbolizes hope in the future, and its presence in the work adds a positive and optimistic dimension. Overall, Almond Blossom is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and delicacy of nature in spring. With his innovative use of color and simple composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement that continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art. Furthermore, the painting is considered as a reflection of his love for nature and its beauty, and also of his hope and optimism. With its powerful symbolism and poetic delicacy, Almond Blossom is a reminder of the beauty and fragility of life, and a tribute to nature and spring. Number 3. Sunflowers. Sunflowers is one of the most famous paintings by Vincent van Gogh. It was painted in 1888, during his stay in Arles, in the south of France. The painting represents a bouquet of sunflowers, with yellow and brown flowers in an environment full of light and color. The composition of the painting is very simple, with the sunflowers in the foreground and a dark background. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of yellow, brown and orange, to create an environment full of life and movement. The natural light of the sun reflects off the leaves and flowers of the sunflowers, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. Sunflowers are the protagonist of the work, with the flowers drawn with great detail and realism. Van Gogh captures the essence of the beauty and majesty of flowers, showing a relaxed and friendly atmosphere. Sunflowers symbolize light, sun and life, and their presence in the work adds a symbolic and poetic dimension. It is important to note that this painting is one of a series of sunflower paintings that Van Gogh painted during his stay in Arles, where the artist was inspired by nature and the colors of southern France. Van Gogh was fascinated by sunflowers and painted them several times, showing their importance in his art and his life. Also, it is interesting to mention that this painting was one of the first that Van Gogh sent to his friend and patron, Paul Gauguin, in an effort to entice him to come to Arles and work together. Overall, Sunflowers is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and majesty of flowers. With his innovative use of color and simple composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement that continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art. Furthermore, the painting is considered a reflection of his love for nature and its beauty, and also of his fascination with sunflowers. With its powerful symbolism and poetic delicacy, sunflowers is a tribute to nature and sunlight. Number 2. Lilies. Lilies is one of the most famous paintings by Vincent van Gogh. It was painted in 1889, during his stay at St. Paul de Mosseli, a psychiatric asylum in St. Remy de Provence. The painting represents a bouquet of white and yellow lilies, placed in a vase, on a table with a white cloth. The composition of the painting is very simple, with the lilies in the foreground and a dark background. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of yellow, white and green, to create an environment full of life and movement. The natural light of the sun reflects off the leaves and flowers of the lilies, creating a warm and welcoming atmosphere. The lilies are the protagonist of the work, with the flowers drawn with great detail and realism. Van Gogh captures the essence of the beauty and delicacy of flowers, showing a relaxed and pleasant atmosphere. The lilies symbolize purity and innocence, and their presence in the work adds a symbolic and poetic dimension. It is important to note that this painting is one of a series of floral-themed paintings that Van Gogh painted during his stay in St. Paul de Mosseli, where the artist was inspired by nature and the colors of Provence. 
Van Gogh was attracted to lilies and painted them on several occasions, showing their importance in his art and his life. In addition, it is interesting to mention that this painting is considered one of the most accomplished in Van Gogh's series of lily paintings, with great detail and realism in the flowers, and a great contrast between the yellow and white tones of the lilies. And the dark background. Overall, Lilies is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and delicacy of flowers. With his innovative use of color and simple composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of life and movement that continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art. Furthermore, the painting is considered as a reflection of his love for nature and its beauty, and also of his fascination with lilies and their symbolism. With its powerful symbolism and its poetic delicacy, Lirios is a tribute to nature and the purity of flowers. Number 1. The Starry Night. The Starry Night is one of the most famous and admired paintings by Vincent van Gogh. It was painted in 1889, during his stay at St. Paul de Mosselli, a psychiatric asylum in St. Remy de Provence. The painting represents a night landscape with a starry sky and a field in the foreground, with a tree and a path. The composition of the painting is very simple, with the starry sky and the field in the foreground and a dark background. Van Gogh used a palette of intense and saturated colors, with shades of blue, purple and green, to create an environment full of mystery and beauty. The light of the stars and the moon illuminate the landscape, creating a magical and mysterious atmosphere. The starry sky is the protagonist of the work, with the stars and the moon drawn with great detail and realism. Van Gogh captures the essence of the beauty and majesty of the night sky, showing an environment full of mystery and beauty. The starry sky symbolizes eternity and the immensity of the universe, and its presence in the work adds a symbolic and poetic dimension. It is important to note that this painting is considered one of the most important of Van Gogh's career, and one of the most famous works in the history of art. Van Gogh was inspired by the nocturnal nature and his own experience of being locked up in the asylum, and tried to capture the beauty and mystery of the night in this painting. The use of color is especially notable in The Starry Night, with Van Gogh using deep blue and purple tones to represent the sky and green tones to represent the countryside, creating great contrast and a magical atmosphere. Also notable is the use of the brush, with Van Gogh using fast, strong strokes to represent the stars and the moon, and softer strokes to represent the field and the tree, creating a sensation of movement and life. Overall, The Starry Night, is a Van Gogh masterpiece that captures the beauty and mystery of nature at night. With his innovative use of colors and simple composition, Van Gogh creates a scene full of mystery and beauty, which continues to be admired around the world. It is considered one of the most representative works of his career and one of the most famous in the history of art. In addition, the painting is considered as a reflection of his love for nature and its beauty, and also of his fascination with the night and the starry sky. With its powerful symbolism and its poetic delicacy, the starry night is a tribute to nature and the immensity of the universe.